Question number 111. Which of the following is not correct for the agent which is responsible for potato spindle tuber disease? Potato spindle tuber disease or PSTD is caused by viroids. So these viroids, they are smallest self-replicating particles. It is true. They were discovered by T.O. Dino. It is also true. They are obligate parasites. It is also true. They cause diseases in both plants and animals. No, they cannot cause diseases in animals. They can cause diseases in plants only. So the correct option for the given question is option number 4. Let's move to the next question. Question number 112. Kuru disease is caused by some proteinaceous infectious particles and these proteinaceous infectious particles are called prions. So the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's move to the next question. Question number 113. Lichens cannot tolerate air pollution, especially due to SO2. Lichens cannot grow in the areas where SO2 pollution is high. So they are good indicators of air pollution. So the correct option for the given question is option number 2. Let's move to the next question. Question number 114. Which of the following is incorrect about roots? They are positively geotropic, yes, and negatively phototropic, means away from the light and towards the ground, it is correct. Roots that directly elongate from radical are called tap roots, this is also correct, mostly seen in dicots. Fourth option, adventitious roots develop from any part of plant other than radical, yes, those roots which develop from any part of the plant other than radical are called adventitious roots. For example, prop roots, stilt roots. So, this is also correct. Third option, fibrous roots are found in all dicots. No, they are found in monocots, not in all dicots. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's move to the next question. Question number 115, root hairs are present in the region of. If you see the regions in the root then you will find that at the tip you will find the root cap above just above it you will find the meristematic region and just above it you will find the zone of elongation and above the zone of elongation there is the zone of maturation where root hairs are found so the correct option for the given question is option number four let's move to the next question 